What is up? I'm Moana Turtle, and today we'll be having another Pokemon opening. We're going to be opening on the product that is the biggest victim of the crazy hype that is Hidden Fates. And I'm not talking about the people that are struggling to find product in their stores, not even talking about the Australians that have to pay like quadruple the price to get product, uh, although they probably have the worst. I'm talking about this product right here, Porygon Z GX Box. Says right on it, Porygon ZGX is battle ready, but I'm pretty sure no one or <laughs> very few people are ready for Porygon Z. This guy just got the bad luck, bad draw about when to be released in the midst of all this hidden fate type. So, but we're gonna give it some love. We're gonna open not one, but two of these boxes. And um, yeah, we'll give it the, we'll give it its day in the sun, but then we're going back to hidden fate. So let's get into this opening. All right, so we're almost ready. Uh, they never gave this product a chance. They got this, let's see if I can show it. Got these tabs and I am struggling to get them out. The first one, the code card got demolished, but then yeah, you can see it's damaged right there. Probably some on the bottom. Actually, the bottom looks okay. So we did the bottom half. The top half did get pretty beat up and I'm not sure how to get it out. This is terrible design. Uh, at least for oh geez no this one's gonna be even worse but how do you get this product how do you get this part out I kind of just smacked it let's see yeah I can I'm not sure if you can see it but I can definitely feel it. it's kind of bent very annoying but let's take a look at the card Porygon Z this is stage two so the bar is really high 240 HP Troubleshooting. Once in your turn, before your attack, you may discard a special energy from this Pokemon. If you do, heal 80 damage from it. Man, it, imagine if this was like not troubleshooting, but I don't know, attacking, did 80 damage. Then maybe I think this card could be worth it. Combine that with the other Porygon Z with the crazy code. Mm, that that could be something. Uh, abnormal overheating 160. This Pokemon is now burned. You know, that, that just doesn't work. You could throw a triple acceleration energy, but then you can't use it for troubleshooting because it's already gone. And then critical error, search your deck for up to 10 cards and, dis and discard them. Then shuffle your deck. What is the point of that? <laughs> this card is all around bad. Man, no love for this product, and especially for a really cool card. And... I had some hope when they made the other Porygon Z, was it in Unbroken Bonds? With the crazy code, but, and it would have been nice if they kind of paired together better than this, but it doesn't seem to be the case. Uh, a little bit unfortunate, not crazy about it, but let's go into the opening. For these, we got our standard XY Evolutions. Lost Thunder, which is nice, two unified minds, which is great. XY is like, uh, like Thanos, he's, he's inevitable. So we're going to start with those Mega Blastoise pack arts. Let's see what we can get. Let's see what Mega would we like. Let's go. I, don't, I, I could go for a Turtle Mega. Let's get that Blastoise. Let's see. We got Machoke. Super Potion. Charizard Spirit Link. I like the sound of that. A Caterpie. Ghastly. Diglett. A Rattata. Ooh, we do got a break. Very nice. Nine Tails break. Arcanine. I feel like these cards are not very well received. They hold almost no value, but they are cool. I like the breaks. I have a binder collection of the breaks, and to be honest, the whole thing costs like less than $50, so that was pretty sweet. No love for them. That's okay because made it real easy to grab essentially every single one for pack number two of evolutions we have a Nido Reno de evolution spray Brock's grit Diglett Caterpie Poliwag a reverse energy not bad not bad and then a Hitmonchan hollow okay that's a pretty good pack right there Put these guys off to the side uh, do these guys deserve sleeves We'll give the reverse energy a sleeve. I don't think I'm going to sleep the Hitmonchan. All right, let's move on to Lost Thunder. Let's see. Zero Aura would be insane. 
Such a good card, still. Lost Thunder, is that plus Epilune? It's a Celestial Storm. Whoa! So much for either one of those. Let's go through this one fast. I think, is there... There's, oh, there's a lot of Prism Stars actually in this one. Carbink, Shenotic, Fairy Charm, Onyx, Morlul, a Mareep, Litwick, Chigorita, Morty, and then a Zip. Ooh, Zip Strike a Sprint. Actually, a very good card. Once during your turn before you attack, you may discard your whole hand and draw four cards. Probably not as good as like Oranguru, especially when it, you do have to evolve it, but a useful mechanic nonetheless. I feel like a lot of electric decks are running at least one of those. Alright, we got Electabuzz, Kecleon, Netball, very nice card right there, Ralts, Dedene, Cyndaquil, Pineco, Eevee, a Suicune, okay, pretty cool, that's probably a rare, nice. And, ooh, Lugia GX. I don't think I have the full art or the rainbow, but that would actually be a cool card, Lugia. Anything that is Lugia kind of has more sustainability as far as holding value. Definitely more so than Ho-Oh. I think I like Ho-Oh just because I felt like he was not the underdog, but the least less appreciated of the two. So I have a soft spot for Ho-Oh just because Lugia was cooler. All right, on to Unified Minds. Let's see, what's what do we need from Unified Minds? Obviously, we need Tortugas. Let's get a Mew Mewtwo. That'd be pretty sweet. Those things. Uh, Mewtwo is still all over the place. Ooh, Welder. All the decks that are good right now, in my opinion, are good because of Welder. If you can make it work with Welder, you can make it work. We got a Lolan Marowak for our first pack. Going pretty fast. As always, guys, if you do like the content, do me a favor, hit that like button. Um, let's see. Join the Discord if you've yet already. Things are going great in there. Caracasa, this is not the turtle we're looking for. Great potion. No matter how many unified mines I open on PTCGO, I cannot get a third great potion. Young Goose, Cryo Gunnel, Litwick, Drillbur, Slaycoth, Slaycoth again, and then a Toxapack. You know, not only did they not give Porygon Z very good. Make them very strong. They released them during Hidden Fates. And the packs are not that good. <laughs> All angles. This product stinks so far. Alright, we got a Steeny, a Zelf, Dedene, Cryogunnel, Marini, Formantis, a Riolu, Purloin, a Tranquil, followed by a Crustle. All right. No love for this product, but we got one last pack. Can we get some last pack magic? All right, Darkness Energy, Sableye, Swadloon, Flying Flenium Z, Fletchender, a Snover. I do like that Snover. Murkrow, that's a cool one too. Execute, a Lolan Grimer. A cottony and our last pack for the opening guys as always thanks for watching Ooh, just a drapeon all right we did get a reverse energy which is not nothing and then a Lugia GX Hitmonchan as well but this will probably be our base let's just take a quick look 30 plus psychic 30 more damage times the amount of energy extra punch Pokemon that's pretty good uh, it's not an evolution so you can't use triple acceleration unfortunately and then Pelagic Blade. This Pokemon can't use Pelagic Blade during your next turn. That's not that strong. I think the biggest downfall of this is it's colorless, so there's no chance of applying weakness. Um, but like, because let's say this was Psychic, and then if you do have the advantage, especially with, you know, let's say Mewtwo, for example, I think it's probably weak to Psychic as well. Um, and that thing probably has you know three plus energy that would be 90 120 240 but the fact that this thing is colorless i think just kind of puts them out of range of essentially everything really cool art though and porygon z missed on all fronts in my opinion uh but 
All right, we gave it a day in the sun, and tomorrow we'll be right back to Hidden Fates. As always, guys, thanks for watching. I'm Moana Turtle, and I'll catch you guys next time.